Hello world. It's Chatty Dad One here with you. Um I just have a major curiosity. Um why do they take some people's videos and hack them to pieces? And then other people's videos they let them play all the way. Now some I've noticed that they do hack some of them too, but there's not a lot that, that get hacked. And um, I know that the uh, the numbers that they show on there are very, very off, very wrong. I um, I run two different channels, and the numbers say different on each one. Um, you can go. Well, I've seen other people do the same kind of videos of what's going on with their channel, what's going on with their numbers, what's going on with this and that. Things don't add up, and uh, you know, Andrew Breitbart just was killed or found dead, whatever. Um, I know they've been doing some butchering on my videos. I know that much for sure. And, uh, you know, hey, there ain't a lot I can do about it. You know, I don't have uh, control in what they do, what buttons they push. All I can do is just keep trying. And so I will. Just do my best. Anyway, I do. But, you know, I'm just curious why they do some and why they don't do others. Because uh, it really doesn't make sense, especially when you've got others doing who knows what, I mean, doing some major, major scuzzy stuff out there. Uh, and I'm reporting on chemtrails and the fact that China is um, cloud seeding and they're right out in the open that, you know, saying that their cloud seeding works like, works like magic. It's beautiful. They have a National Day Parade and it's cloudy skies. They go in there with some jets and and uh, by golly, they have sunny skies with clouds encroaching everywhere in a circle radius. Um, yeah, check it out. Got a freaking fever blister here from working in that chicken house. Freaking ticks me off. <laughs> I'm going to try to get a picture of that paper with my... With my phone, my camera phone, um, Monday, Monday night, I'll see if I can't post it up for you, if it makes it on the web, because these guys are totally in control, you know, and, and I don't pay them money, you know, I, I'm doing enough advertising for them as is. The same reason why I will not wear clothing advertising other people's stuff. I don't wear clothing that has um, Coca-Cola written on it. I don't wear stuff that's got, you know, the Nike symbol across the chest. If they want me to do some advertising, they need to pay me, you know. Um, I was in the modeling business for a few years. And I know how that whole racket is run. And believe me, there's a lot of you people out there that are giving them a lot of free advertising. And, you know, I'm not going to do it. Not unless they pay me to do it. Because I've been paid before to, to advertise people's stuff, to wear people's stuff, the Gap. Um, London Fog, all several different ones, you know. 
and uh, they need to pay us for, for wearing their stuff, for getting it out there and pushing it on people. But I refuse to do it. Everything I wear is, is plain. No logos, no nothing. Like I say, not unless they're going to pay me or give it to me. If they give me the clothing, then I'll, you know, I'll wear it. Um, the kind of work I do, I've got like Lowe's. They'll give me hats and t-shirts and stuff all the time. Man, I'll wear those. No problem. Hey, if they're going to give it to me, you doggone right I'll wear them. I'm, I'm, I appreciate it, you know. <laughs> That's that much less work clothes i got to buy. <laughs> but anyway, I don't know if this will get out to you even. They're cutting my videos to pieces. And, I, you know, it's really good, some good information, too. There's a lot of us, a lot of you out there with very good information that is getting out there. And they don't like it. The powers that be do not like us speaking our mind and finding these articles that the main media will not play. But there's tons of stuff. You know, check out the London Guardian. It is a really, really good one. And it's no... I don't think it's very much of a coincidence that uh, Andrew Breitbart, one of the founders of the Drudge Report, came out just there at LPAC and said that he's got a video on Obama in his college days that he is not going to like. And now all of a sudden he's dead and he was supposed to release this video yesterday? Or I mean the day before yesterday? The first? You know, Alex, Alex Jones speaks on it some more too. His days are probably numbered. Glenn Beck's days are probably numbered. Um, Michael Savage days, Sean Hatton. Anybody who will not sell out to these guys is probably has their days numbered. But we are listening to them and we will stand up for them and with them. Um, anyway, all I know is just to do your best. Love your neighbor because they're the ones who's going to be there when the stuff hits the fan. Don't treat people online better than you would your friend and your neighbor because the people online are getting a peephole view of who they're looking at. Sometimes, most of the time, not even that much, okay? You know detailed information about your neighbors. But when the catastrophe hits, your neighbors are going to be there. The peephole guy on the internet, he's not going to be there anymore. You don't know who's telling the truth. You don't know who's lying. You don't know who's a spy. You don't know who's not. You know? Go figure. All I can tell you is um, use good judgment. If ye, any of ye lack wisdom, let him ask of God. Um, that'll clear a lot of things up. I, I know it has for me a lot of times. Anyway, I uh, just wanted to drop a few lines and say what's on my mind. Um, I'm uh, trying to post a couple new videos of the whole China thing on my other website. It's um, Chad Noise Boy. Go check them out if they make it. Hopefully they'll make it because they don't know that it's me. But I'm sure they will now. I think they was catching on anyways. Anyway, God bless. Good luck. Chatty Daddy 1 over in it.